Welcome back in Wicking family to another F1 Clash video. In today's video, we're going to be jumping into our final round uh, for the Saudi Arabian Grand Prix. Yesterday, we did pretty well. We did uh, perfect and we did perfect in the qualifying round. So hopefully today we can put up another 376 uh, is the uh, plan for today. So let's go see uh, what we could do here. Let's try and get our first match on the way and see what we could do here at Jeddah. There we go for first race at uh, Jeddah for this one. Let's see where we qualify. Nice looking good so far. P3, P6, we'll take it. And we'll see. All right, so we're going to go mediums. And we're going to go for power boost for Jeddah here. So we're going to go dead fast. And then we're going to come back and go with the Eclipse. Uh, for or Ocon. Let's go. Fast start strategy. Oh, it's a real player as well. Come on, get up there, Ocon. Nice start from both drivers. All right, we see Perez taking P1, so he's gone. It's a matter of now Ocon making his way up to P2. Down the inside, yes he can. Right, we're gonna cut him down there, and we'll just let Perez keep going, cut those off. All right, let's see what tires is in front. Mediums on Perez, so we're gonna push or Ocon to pass Perez. Down the inside, there we go. Come on, pull away now. All right, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna bring in Ocon to pit here early. Instead of trying to go for three laps with him, we're going to go no service in with Perez. And we're going to go no service in with Ocon. I'm going to bring him over to soft tires. So he'll be on the same strategy as Perez. So he should get out before Perez stock. There we go. No stock in. Rival bringing in is Perez as well. Switching up his strategy, I guess. Makes sense. He went back to medium tires. And then he has P3, who's going to hold him up. Verstappen, who's going to hold him up a little bit up for us on hards as we create distance with our drivers. Now we see is Ocon, team order, and his Perez slowing him down. So great race to the rival. All he has to do now is try to score P3, P4 as we have secured our 1-2 positions. Uh, and we're going to go in with service in now with both drivers. Only thing that could uh, be an issue now would be a safety car. And we don't want that at all. Alright, so no safety car please. And we should be good to secure our 1-2 here. Let's cut down so he doesn't run out. Let's cut down so he doesn't run out. Don't want to lose any time going into pit. And they ran out same way. All right. So we're going to lose a little bit of time to the rival. But we have a huge amount of distance. So no worries. And we should get out before the stocking. There we go. And we're just going to leave them on full blast again. For two laps. And then we're going to cut them down for the last uh, set of laps and we see the rival miss pit there with Perez so he's gonna run out of tires so his Perez is gonna run out of tires right here around this lap I doubt that Perez is gonna be able to make it back to pit and we're just gonna come back to soft sweep no servicing uh, with or Perez there and we'll come back to soft sweep no servicing with or Ocon and we'll just keep them on full blast. All right, we could slow them down around here so we don't lose uh, that time. Going into pit, see the rival coming back now to hard tires uh, to go to finish with his Perez holding down P4. So he's basically secured. P3 and P4, really great job from him. 
scoring as much as you possibly can uh, in a race is the best thing you could do. And we could just cut our drivers to regular driving from here as his Ocon makes his way to pit. And you can see Perez kind of held the line there for P5, P6. So Ocon can get to pit. Uh, only P5 is going to be an issue as P6 will be going to pit. So you'll have to repass P4 now, which is Perez on hearts. Which I don't see those hearts going to finish for Perez. So you'll have to make another stop. Let's give the rival a great race. Well done. Give him a little good luck. Thanks, man. All right. So first 47 down in the bag looking good. Now let's hope we can continue. Seven more to go. And so here we go. Crossing the line. P1. Ocon now to cross the line in P2. All right, so great race from board or drivers there. Great race from the rival there as well. Uh, scoring as much as he possibly can there, securing P3, P4. Uh, great race to him and good luck to you, sir. All right, so let's jump on into our next race and see what we could do in that one. Here we go for our next race. We are on Mexico for this one. Let's see what kind of qualifiers we get here at Mexico. Come on, Ocon, get up there with Perez. At P5, P8 for us, we got out qualified. P2, P3 for the rival. Uh, all right, so we're gonna go. We're gonna go for. Uh, I want to go for. Let's go, Lumberjack. And for my second driver, I want to go for a fast pit stop. So I'm going to go for the odd boost. Where is it? The odd. There we go. Hopefully we can get back in the pits. Uh, we are going to get out fast. Rival start. It looks like it's a real rival as well. Let's go fast start method. Yep, it's a real rival. Fast start method for both or drivers. Down the inside goes Perez. Hunting down the rival as opted for the Jin and the Kawhi boost, which is really nice. All right, so we're going to keep them fired up. You see the Jin and the Kawhi pulling away from the Lumberjack here. That's Okan. Get in there, Okan. Right, down the inside. All right, so one down. Come on, Okan. Ocon not being able to go through the AIs here. We want him to go and catch up, but it doesn't look like he's going to do that at all. Rival on their conserve. We are going to conserve, but not this lap. We're going to use the straight, and then we're going to cut him down to conserve. All right, so cut down to conserve here. As for Ocon unable to make up any places we should have gone for the dead fast with Ocon here instead of going for the fast bit time all right we're gonna boost or Perez now from here into pit he's gonna come to mediums and go to finish or we could come back to softs and go to finish with Perez Ocon Coming back to mediums and going to finish boosting for the entire race. Can't pick up a position. All right, let's cut him down there. Oh, man, it looks like our 47 run is over. Yeah, we got outmatched here. And our drivers are not even trying to perform. Especially or Ocon, he's not even trying to get up there uh, to get into the fight. Come on, we should get the jump on P6. Come on, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. Nope, he got out behind. Even with the fast bit time boost. Great race by the rival. And that's the end. Nothing more we could do. 
we didn't get a good match we were hope that we were hoping for here so we're just gonna score as much as we possibly can and that's the end of our perfect score run let's cut Ocon down now nothing more he can do than p5 and we'll keep Perez cut him down now to regular driving let him try and hold his position in p2 can't even hold his position yeah so in the end great race from the rival we did our best nothing more we could do as i said if you don't get a good qualifiers there's not much you could do or Akan wasn't up to it here so we'll take it at least we're we might be scoring our new personal best at least so yeah we'll take that thanks man yeah good luck man all right so let's jump on into our next race after our Ocon finishes and see what we could do in that one. All right, there we go. 42 points, so that's down by five. That's down by a lot. That's down by a lot. Ocon wasn't having it at all. Yeah maxed out opponent as you know we are not max so yeah it is what it is let's jump into the next one here we go for our next race sandboard for this one let's see uh what we could do here how will qualify usb kind of knew the game was going to throw me a curveball like the last race uh, but it is what it is not much you could do so since our perfect run is over we're just gonna go back to not using uh, too much premium boost here as it makes no sense now but we're still going to try and score our best possible score but might as well we save those premium boosts because we're not going to get our aim All right so we could still use some boost that could get the job done nice inside line there from Perez there we go good start from both drivers and one to secure here i just knew the game was going to throw me that curveball they're just not going to allow you to <laughs> to get that perfect score especially if you're not at max level all right let's go let's keep Ocon on regular driving here as we keep perez pushing let's see P3 is on mediums as well. So we're going to keep him on regular driving. So P3 don't get too close to our Ocon. We're, we're going to do uh, 4. And we're going to do 3. And come back and do 3 with Perez on conserve. So let's put in our go to pit order with Perez now. We're going to do service in with him here because we're, we're just going to bring him back to another set of softs and let him go to finish on conserve on those softs. While Ocon, we're going to bring him around and come back for softs and go to finish on those softs. Let's boost now or Ocon. And then let's cut down Perez to conserve to do his four laps. And then we're going to bring Ocon around now with service in for a fresh set of softs. I want him to create as much distance as possible to P3. As much distance as possible, Ocon. Let's go. All 
All right now we're gonna go in so signs and Verstappen should pit it pit behind us so we shouldn't have a problem there let's keep going now we could just cut or walk on to regular driving from there we shouldn't have a problem with him there on regular driving And that should be a 47 secured for us. Now these 47s don't feel as good as they previously did uh, when we were going perfect. <laughs> oh man, still can't believe uh, we got such a bad match. It wasn't a bad match, we just got outmatched there uh, by that rival. I, I kind of just knew the game was going to throw that in there. I was just looking for it, but I was just hoping that when it does happen, it's nice and close, you know, so we could at least attempt to try and see if we can squeeze in front of the rival. Uh, but that wasn't the case this time around. So we'll keep trying. We'll keep trying. Don't get our spirits uh, damped. We'll keep trying. All right, so here we go. 47 secured. Let's just wait now for our drivers to finish the race and then we'll jump on into the next one. So 47 here, secured, component failed on the rival Perez. All right, let's jump on into the next race and see what we can do in that one. Here we go for our final race of the video. We're on France for this one. Nice P3, P8. Eight. Ocon kind of dropping off there. All right, so we're gonna go Warrior up in front, and we're gonna go Instinct behind. Let's go. Nice inside line there from Perez to take P1. Ocon up to P7. Can he squeeze P6? Yes, he can. Now inside line. He went wide, so he didn't get to go to the inside of Leclerc on and Perez there. So we'll just let Perez keep going. Ocon, can he go inside? No, he cannot. We're going to cut him down there because he's not going to get the overtake done. And we'll just let Perez go. What tires is in front of or Ocon softs Leclerc? So he's gonna hold up our Ocon here. Leclerc on softs. Perez creating good distance. We could cut him down there so we could get three laps as we continue to push with our Ocon. Bring in Perez for softs with no servicing on that third. We're gonna let Ocon continue to go. And so we have a few softs and medium crossing the line with 50%. So he's good on conserve uh, to go. But what I might do here is change the strategy and bring Ocon to pit for softs with no servicing as well. So let's boost him to pit here because those guys on mediums will be going I think they're gonna go for another lap so we're gonna try and undercut uh, those guys on mediums with our Ocon and yeah, there they go Ooh, only one went the rest came into pit go 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 Ocon so we're back out in P7. We're just going to now boost or Ocon for two laps and see if we can squeeze through these hard tires. Should be able to get through them. 
without problems as he's on the softer compound. Outside of Leclerc, good block from Leclerc there, glitchy. So Leclerc is going to hold him. As long as you see your drivers try to overtake and you see the game becoming glitchy like that, whenever your drivers attempt to overtake and the game become glitchy, you're stuck. <laughs> That's what you are right there. Stuck, my friend. And that means you're not going to overtake that driver that you're trying to overtake so easily. Whenever your driver attempts, the game is just going to glitch and push you back. Oh, we weren't boosting our Perez. So we could go an extra lap with him. Yeah, so the game is just going to keep glitch and push you back as you see it's been doing here. So we're just going to bring Ocon now in to pit. Nothing we could do about that. He's not going to pass. Everybody is going to be out. Now he finally squeezed past Leclerc. Everybody is going to be out on mediums and hard tires as we go to pit and come back to mediums that we're going to have on full blast. Perez going around for another lap because he was conserving. As long as we can get the jump on these guys. Then we go we're back out in P7 with or Ocon. Now, all of these guys on hards and mediums, Ocon should have tires up on them uh, going to the end. But uh, they're a good distance away. Perez P2. Let's see if Perez go to pit. If not, then we should catch up with Ocon. Nice. So Perez didn't go to pit there. Exactly what we want to see. So that should give us some time with our Ocon now to go and catch up. And so all these hards and mediums will be going back to pit. So Ocon has a possibility of catching up. Only Perez is basically going to hold off Ocon here. A safety car will be perfect for Ocon right now. Not, not really perfect because Perez is still going to get in and out uh, in P2. There's no way he's going to get by Perez. But he should get up to P3 though. As all of them are going to go to pit. So now you'll only have Perez to pass. There he is exiting. If he didn't get held up by Leclerc, he would have caught up to Perez and possibly pass. So we have one lap to pass Sergio Perez, who's on softs and we're on medium. So that's not going to happen. Let's keep trying Ocon. Good try. Push him off. Good try Ocon. Good try. One more chance. One more chance. Inside line. There you go Ocon. There you go. Great drive from Ocon to squeeze in front of Perez there uh, to secure the 1-2 position. So the undercut was the best option, even though Leclerc kind of held us up for like two laps as we were behind him on softs, on full boost while he was on mediums. He was on hards, I should say, uh, when we should have passed him uh, long ago and secure our 1-2. But yeah, in the end, the results came. So let's jump on into our next race. Oh, it's the final race of this video. So let me know down in the comments how you guys uh, are doing in your events. Let me know down in the comments. Uh, we managed to pull up another 47. Hopefully we get to pull up the last 47. And I have been doing an experiment uh, with this setup that I'm currently running in this event. Uh, so if you want to uh, know about the experiment that I was running and the setup that I'm running now, make sure to stick around for the next video. Uh, where we're going to talk about that in that video. So remember to smash the like button if you haven't already done so. Subscribe to the channel if you're not yet subscribed. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace. Walk good, guys. Bye. Shout out to Vidmantis, Alfredo Jr., Touch My Dilly, and Xavier Magni. Forget his evil way.